My name is Dion Fadimati. Um, I've been an apprentice for six months now. Why I chose sign writing is because I wanted to get in touch with my creative side and I thought it would be a great opportunity to build a career. Uh, smudge sign, well basically this is my family away from home. We help each other. Um, I've learned a lot, a lot of skills from my supervisor, also my boss and also my peers here. Smudge Signs was started six and a half years ago. Uh, we're a sign manufacturing company with uh, extensive in-house sign manufacturing equipment. And so, yeah, pretty much a one-stop shop, really. We believe it's important having apprentices on board to upskill and bring through the next generation of sign writers. I'm, I'm Nicole Swain from Fine Signs here in Tony. I finished my apprenticeship 2012. So Fine Signs has been going for about 31 years now. So you started up in the garage at home. And then I came into the business in 2005. I went off and studied other things and decided my dad's quite a cool boss. And he was at the time he was getting a digital printer and I'd been doing photography so I knew a bit more about computers than he did. And then he was looking for a new apprentice and I decided I wanted a set of brushes as well. So I got to do it. Coming from someone who wasn't in the industry, didn't know it at all, I love it. Um, and the reasons I love it are because it's so varied no day's the same. The variety in the job is, is pretty awesome. It's always challenging. It's always you know, something fresh and new, new ideas. It's using my mind now instead of just physical labour. I have learnt a lot of things, a lot of skills, which, which um, is quite hard at times, but um, that's why the boys, they're all over here to help. From window frosting all the way to CNC, cutting 3D letters, welding, vinyl little wrap around cars. It's another highlight for me, love that. Company signage, the building signage, big pile on plinths. Also, there is a bit of electronics um, involved as well. I mean, all that comes together is amazing. I like sign art in many, just the variety. You start from someone will come in not knowing what they want, you get to sit down, design it for them, right through to making it and installing it. We're quite lucky in the fact that we still do a lot of old school stuff, so we'll do a lot of hand painted work instead of sticking it with vinyl. Um, we still do vehicle wrap. Today I'm digital printing. Yesterday I was out painting little house signs all around this guy's garden and on his sheds in his letterbox. You need to have a passion in something regardless what, what type of business or what type of trade um, uh, that you decide to do. I think if you don't have a passion in something, um, I don't think you'll go far. 2009 I put my hand up to do run letterheads because they hadn't been in Wellington for a while and um, I knew about Daniel Reeve who did the calligraphy for Lord of the Rings and I got in touch with him to come in and sort of give us a demonstration and talk to the sign writers and I've been able to travel to um, Melbourne and study with people like Luca Barcelona who's really big, he started as a graffiti artist. It's just amazing to see how to learn the different hands and the skills come in handy and you get to learn proper letter form with calligraphy, so quite precise some of them and others are quite flowy. The Canon, on top of our workshop, that started as a da dad's dream, he decided he could put a Canon on top of the building, but that started off as a drain pipe and some PVC, and then I spent two weeks ago just aging it up, so he spray painted it and then lots of layers of um, different coloured paint to make it look really old. And... I can basically use these, these life skills to apply in the everyday life. Whether I want to, you know, um, build something at home, which makes my partner feel a lot better. Whatever I learn here, I can definitely apply in any other area wherever, I, you know, my career path will take me after this. Become a designer, I don't know if you're a bit creative and don't want to sit in a desk the whole time like a lot of designers do. You can you know, be a sign writer, do the designing, be out making. I do recommend sign writing to anyone who's interested.